you know, in photography, it's a really serious game. So when you can find some time to have some fun, you definitely make fun. weeks of excitement and years of dreaming, I was finally off to explore an incredible place, the World UNESCO Heritage Site, the Dolomites in Northern Italy. There was going to be snow, so I was excited to see what it would look like, and also, I get to wear my funky ski hat. Like. So after a very long journey we started obviously before dawn um, some beautiful conditions along the way and the drive here as well was absolutely stunning so we've just arrived here at St. what's the name of the place we're at? St. what? St. Johan St. Johan's Church so I presume this is probably one of the biggest areas people would come to when they first arrive here to get this photograph it is beautiful to be fair and if I give you a look behind us here you've got this church and in the distance if this will leave my face but you probably won't I'll show you this way you have the dynamites so it's a beautiful spot gonna get a couple of photographs here anyway and uh, we'll check back in in a moment I can see why this place is so popular from people come to get photographs particularly from an Instagram point of view because it is beautiful you can see that you have the church here in the background and then as I said above it you've got the beautiful Dolomites the light that we have at the moment um, is nothing spectacular but it's actually really nice as well at the same time because you're getting nice light that's reaching the mountains on the very top you're getting a nice bit of darkness as well as it comes down and then you've got the church below which is in full shade to take my photograph right now I'm at f11 and taking 140 to a second ISO is at 50 that's it pretty straightforward no need for filters no real highlights to do with either so it's a pretty straightforward shot but beautiful spot great place to be able to start this trip and I'm really looking forward now to the next couple of days because I think we're going to get some beautiful photos and some fantastic locations Uh, I hope not. Alright buddy, let's go. You know, you know, in photography, it's a really serious game. So, when you can find some time to have some fun, you definitely make fun. So what we're doing right now is, as you can see with Dermot, we have one of these sleds. So, we're going to go back down the hill. We're going to go back down the hill in style. And you know what? I'll take you guys with me. So let's go. We'll have some fun going down this. Hopefully we don't crash. So apparently we're having a race now. Uh, yeah, so Dermot's over here. Bernard is behind us. And I think to start off, really, you just got to kick off. And you got to hope for the best. So yeah. You ready to go? Three, two, one. You see
see on Jeremy's face was pure joy. Me, on the other hand, is sheer fear. Fear that a Patrick seemed to appear out of nowhere, and I was hurtling towards him out of control. Luckily, I missed him by centimeters, and he survived to capture this. So that's the first part of the arrival into Dolomites done. Um, we're going to head up now to Santa Maddalena and it gives a beautiful view of the same mountains but a different church in front of it. I think we're going to get nice light so I'll finish up on this episode and uh, let's join each other again on the next episode when we're up looking at the spectacular view. Milo!